guys thank you so much for watching i'm dr linda kramer okay now as you know i try not to say who i politically align with but i'll tell you what i have noticed over the last two days is that there is chaos particularly with one certain blue party okay without naming names we all know who is right now living in the chaos so how do they get so chaotic that's the question so right now i'm sitting here and i know what's going on with these people when we live in chaos we create chaos we live in the chaos and we pass that chaos off onto everybody else so that's why we're seeing all these karens and kevins going around stealing trump signs this is why people now are going around destroying Halloween displays in people's front yards, trespass, break and enter and all these other criminal offences because they feel so deserving, so self-serving and most of all they feel privileged where they feel that they can get away with this sort of stuff because they live in chaos. When we live in chaos, all that blah, 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 that goes on in our brains the drama the drama creates chaos now i look at myself today i'm looking at my friends and i'm even looking at extended friends who live down south i've never met i'm looking at friends of mine in america i'm looking at friends of mine in in the uk other parts of europe even the ones that live up north in um, Asia. We are calm. We are collected. We are at peace. Because regardless of who won, we know ultimately that we do not live in chaos. Okay? So when you're out and you're out doing what you do in your lives, look at whether you start in drama look at who around you is creating drama who's doing it who's the first person that texts and says blah, 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 blah. okay the ones that are going off you know i have never in my life thought i would see the day where someone sets up their camera and videos themselves having a childhood tantrum and then posting it to billions of people on youtube showing what a disgusting behavior they possess because they live in the chaos that they themselves have created wow so as i said i'm sitting here today i'm as calm as punch i am that mill pond <laughs> of emotional outbursts today i am not affected because of who won the election and the ones who are that's where you've got to ask yourself why now i just watched this woman who apparently sees spirit guides and she's saying the whole thing was rigged i can tell you i died i went to heaven 20 something years ago and they told me way back then that the only ones doing the lies and the deceit at this point are the ones who did not get in huh funny that you know there's this big psychological test that we do the government knows it they know it they do it but in this test what you do is you create a scenario where everyone goes crazy and you sit back you created it you sit back and you watch the chaos and then you come in as the hero to fix it now i saw camilla at this rally two days ago and she's got not just little bits of glass around her she's in this like dome of not even a needle can penetrate through the gaps of this plat this thing was she shot at twice no so why is she sitting there in this big glass bubble for because she's trying to make out 
that she's a victim too. And it's when we lie about stuff and it's when we deceive our followers. I try and stay unbiased here and I just tell it as I see it and what I hear from her because I trust her impeccably and she's laughing just as good as me. <laughs> Thank you so much. Because they create a situation if you research problem, reaction, solution. Google those three words. They create a problem. So then they come out and get the public sympathy so they get it fixed and they end up with the result that they want. So this is the whole thing that's going on now. And half of them, well, less than half of America are falling for it. Thank God, and I'm going to say it, God, thank you so much that right now people are waking up to what is really going on. When we looked at what happened four years ago, there was people still asleep to it. They were in that fear mode of not knowing what or who to trust. But they finally worked it out. The only person that we trust is number one. The only person that we trust and listen to is number one. And the only one that can take us out of that chaos, the only one who can stop that drama being created where we spew it forward to everybody else that we know is us, me. I'm calm today, but I'll tell you what, I'm celebrating and I'm laughing, not at who won, but how generalized people out there, the population, is reacting to it because the Democrats just got what they wanted. Talk to you all soon. Bye.